Hi everyone, right, we've just come back from Panel, which is a small place where they do car boots on a Wednesday and a Saturday. I was glad I went because we've had an awesome time this morning <coughs> and sorry I'm just going to have a quick drink but I'm going to get things out and share them with you in a minute. Right I'm going to try and share this with you a little bit better. Now there were some awesome things there today. I, it is awful to announce that um, I came away I could have bought an awful lot more but I chose not to do so because I'm sorry, you know, the prices have shot up and I'm not willing to pay. The odd things, yes, I don't mind paying the odd, you know, because I always do a bargain and that and try and sh uh, shoot them down in prices. But um, I just, they're asking way too much now. It's um, really getting, I, I used to look forward to going to charity shops and car boots and I knew I could take £50 come back with several bags full because of the way I cut deals and whatnot with them and I really do bargain for you I barter like hell I have to say but they're not willing to budge these days and they've popped the prices right up so what I'm going to show you today is if I'm not keeping it it's for sale I will give you a price on how much um, but it, I'm not charging, when I go to sh uh, car boots and that, I only charge you what I pay because, um, you know, I go for myself to get the bargains for me and to, you know, work with so that I can do these videos and that. But while I'm there, I pick up as many bargains as I can for you. So if you are interested in what I share, um, I will say what it is, give you a price. And if nobody goes for it, it'll go on the shop. But at the same price, because I'm not going to charge you any more than what I got charged. Right, first off, I needed another headband myself, but I snapped mine by accident. So I've found this, and that's perfect for what I need, because my hair's getting really long again. And uh, it's hard to pin it back. Right. So I'm going to start with this uh, table mat. It is brand new. Never been used. Um, the embroidery on it is exquisite. I don't know if you can see that. It's just beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. And that, I couldn't resist it. Uh, is three pound so you know i can't do them any cheaper i'm only doing what i'm getting my money back that's it once i get my money back you know i'm happy with that because i've bought what i need and i just get these in the hope that somebody else might like them and appreciate them as well so that cloth um is about 16 inches long i think by 12 inches that way 16 by 12 something like that uh, does it say on here wash but it's embroidered and just look at the pattern it's just stunning this can all be cut out you know you could use that in many things in a like a for a fabric journal so the first one that is the cream rectangle uh cloth tablecloth table mat for three pound now I came across this doily and it's beautiful it's big but look you can use these for your leaves and things like that you know that's what I do I just cut them all out put these in my flowers use these in my projects but it was pink and I thought somebody might like that not pretty and that was £2.50 And it's worth it because you these are hard to come by and they're getting rarer and rarer but more expensive so i did get it i mean if nobody wants it i can use it up but you know if somebody would like that that was two pound fifty for the large round pink 
uh, doily. Um, and I'll tell you how expensive it is, right? It was coming to the end of the day and the lady had this for sale and it was kind of hidden on a neck of something. See? It's beautiful. Look at all the different butterflies that you can and all the different projects you can use. But this is what she wanted for it. Now, just hang bear with me. This is what she wanted for it. Nine pound. And I really, really did batter her down. And I got her down to three. So three pound for that. If I can get, I do sometimes get them for less. I've picked these up for a pound. But like I say, everybody's getting more and more expensive. And like, it's on there, nine quid. So, and I battered her right down to three and told her you can get them on internet cheaper. You know, uh, the, they just try it on basically. So that's the butterfly necklace is also three pound. Then I found these. And they're like bohemian uh, earrings. They are gorgeous. I have to say the lady was actually wearing some of them. And they look stunning. Look at those. Beautiful. Nice little hearts. Diamantes. Different gemstones. So yeah. Um, and they were 150 so that's not too bad, is it? That was a good deal for them. A good deal. Let me just... I'll put them all back in later. I can't do it right now. <laughs> now, um, these... These two were a pair. So I'll move that out of the way. Um, she didn't sell them as a set. She sold them, these two as a pair. They're very, very pale pink. And they're both the same size. And then she sold this one as an individual one. She said it's because it's it's darker pink. It doesn't go with it. I said it's the same pattern. But anyway, you just have to, you know, go with the flow. And uh, so the large one I paid one pound fifty, and a pound each for these. And that's all I'm charging you. Okay. So uh, that will be sold. 150 for the large uh, pink doily mat. Or for the pair of light pink. Um, that would be £2. Because they're a pound each. Now I have to say. Sometimes you come across a bargain. And you just have to nab it while you can. And this, I have to say, was a bargain. I'm not going to take it out. As you can see what it is. It is a very delicate, pure cotton table mat. And now for somebody who's doing a shabby sheet bedroom, to have that, I'm not going to take it out. I don't want to get my uh, hands on it or anything like that. It is brand new. But it is a vintage one, if you know what I mean. So, um, and it's little flowers, like daisy flowers uh, in the eyelets. But it's, it's gorgeous, I have to say. It really is pretty. And again, um, that was £4. And I, I can't let that go for any less because that's what I've just paid for it. But it's worth it for what it is. So if you want to do your bedroom nice and you want to have exquisite stuff and you want to have the best, that's one of them. I had to nab it. I couldn't not take it because I knew somebody will want that. It's absolutely stunning. And that's £4. So that's the vintage pure cotton white rectangle um, table mat. Oh, dressing. It's like more for the dressing table. Um, these are... What did I get? These were 150 again. And the reason why I get them is because they've got glass beads, metal beads, little shoes, all different beads dangling from them. They're like a droplet like that. And they're worth it, you know, 150. So if you're interested in any of those, I did get two of them. Uh, 
I nabbed them while she had them. Like I say, if nobody wants... You say it on this video if you want them, and then I, before I put them on the shop, this lot will be going on the shop tomorrow. So you have to say today what you want. And like I say, there's two of those, 150 each. And then I picked up this one, which is gorgeous. I have, I'm not sure. I think it's a bracelet. I'm not sure. You could wear it as a bracelet or an anklet. But it's heavy. And the reason why it's heavy is because it's got the it's all metal but then you've got the rose quartz flowers and droplets and leaves then you've got the polymer clay ones then you've got the crystal um and you know polymer clay more pearly beads glass pearly beads but on the end is a gorgeous it weighs a lot a beautiful pink crystal it's just stunning And so you could take that off and use that somewhere else. So it's just like a, I'm going to call it a bag charm, but it, it's gorgeous. And I have to say that was £3, but I, I will pay that just for the crystal because it's worth it. These are not fakes. These are not this, you know, gen, uh, general cheap crap that people sell. This is um, genuine quartz, rose quartz and uh, crystals and i've got another oh look i didn't see that one another little droplet there and this beautiful crystal off the end pink crystal so that's um three pounds for that one and that will hang anywhere really pretty now this she had um she had them on for five pounds and it's the breast cancer ones but the the thing about this is this is rose quartz these stones are rose quartz but um, although they were selling them for £5, I got them down to a pound. And it's not, and don't look bad at me because of breast cancer. I buy quite uh, quite a few, you know. And I support all charities that, um, I go into lots of shops and spend a lot of my money in charity shops so that I know that I'm doing my bit. I mean, they get everything for free. So you've got to think about it, logically. So, yeah, um... Although they were advertised at five, I got them for one. So that's a pound. Okay. They get enough. If you actually knew what um, they were on per year and how they treat their staff, you wouldn't, you wouldn't go in there, I'll tell you. So then I got these, which are the earrings. Now, this one doesn't have a back on, but I have a back here. Um, so there's my backs and I'm going to put a back on it um, because it needs one so things are easily remedied see so like that that just fits on the back but I just thought snip the back off and they look perfect beautiful AB look at that Is it Aurora Borealis or something like that? Just stunning. And, you know, you have two projects you can put them on. Or wear them. Now, I did get two lots of those. And they were 2 50 But worth it. They're worth it. Just, they really are. I mean, normally I would only pay 150 for them. But they're stunning. So, um, and she wanted two fifty, and I bought two pairs. Um, so, then I found this. This is a bag, a full bag of these, already cut to size. And I think they were for cakes, but it is lace and satin, very soft satin. So, these are 20, I'm sure she said there were 20. Let me just see what it says on the packet. Uh, 22 inches so they're 22 inches long but they make a beautiful flower you know so they will be sold out there was a bag full of them so I'm just going to put them on as 22 inches and uh, gorgeous trim I don't miss anything like that you know me I will you know always look for a bargain now this again is brand new and it's cream and it is gorgeous it is a table mat that will look stunning on a dressing table on your kitchen table 
dining set, whatever you want to put it. It's absolutely beautiful. And if you don't want to use it, you cut all these appliques out and you use them somewhere. But again, that was uh, £3.50. I, for the appliques alone, I'd do it, you know, because you've enough on here um, to do lots of, you could do a full book. Uh, using this applique, a full book. So that was £3.50. I wish I could get them cheaper, I can't. But you know, hey ho, you don't want it, I'll, I'll use them, I'm not fussed. Right, this was a pair, a large doily and a small doily. Well, when I say small, it's not that small. Size of a dinner plate, you know. And um, that was £3 for the set. Which isn't bad because you normally pay about £2 for this one and one fifty for that one. So, um, so that's that large round, small large, uh, small round. Then this one, I bought all these individually, folks. Sorry. So these will be sold individually. Uh, this one I paid one fifty for. But it's beautiful and they're spotless, these. These are clean as hell. Look at that. Just gorgeous. So that's one fifty for that one. This one was two pound, but I, I I get them because they're worth it. Look, it is just beautiful, and it's clean. So that was two pound for that one. If anybody's interested, now I can put them on the shop. You don't have to have them. And then that one um, was a pound for that one. So we keep that as a pound, okay? The round one. Then um, these, these were a pair and they were 50p for the pair. And they've got like little flowers in them. So that's 50p for the pair. Uh, that was 50 pence on its own. So that's this small doily, crocheted doily. Um, and these were 50 pence as well. So this is, yeah, get them right way around. They're 50p a pair. They're cotton, embroidered cotton. These were a pound a piece and they're bobbles. But they have um for flower centers great. But they're bobbles and they're a pound each. And there's four of those. Then I found this necklace which I just love. I just think how summery is that? So they are glass beads, but they've uh, used seed beads to cover them. And I just think that is absolutely gorgeous. And that was £3 as well. Tell you what, the, there was a lot of £3-pounders. <laughs> I was saying to Raymond, God, they're putting the price of three dates, three that. But there you go, you know, it's worth it. Still worth it, obviously. I'll show you these. I got these and these were also £3 each. But they are beautiful watches. Women's watches. And the more bohemian style. Look at that vintage style. And that one. That classy one, that. So if anybody wants a watch, you've got the copper watch at £3, you've got the gold watch at £3 and you've got the vintage watch at £3. So say which one you're after. 
Now that's those. Now, these I bought six of because when I set my table outside when I have my sisters over for lunch, you know, we often have like sauces like tartar sauce, mayonnaise and things like that. And I don't have any dishes for them. So I did treat myself. And if he's there next week, I'm actually going to... The bone china. And I'm actually going to go buy six more if he's there next week. And I love the shell shape of them. It's like a shell. So I've got six of those. For uh, when I... Not just for my sisters, but when I do my dinners. Um, these... Um, Oh, she'd have them a while. You can tell by it packaging as well. It's a bit um, yucky. But I'll put them in fresh bags. These are long beaded necklaces. I bought them because the colour of the beads are stunning. They are only acrylic. But they are gorgeous colours. Look at that. To mix in with your projects. Yeah. And they were £2 each. Unfortunately, I, you know, I got them because I like the beads. And if nobody else wants them, I'll use them myself. Then I got this skirt, which I bought for the fabric. I'm going to take the fabric off. And I knew there was something wrong with this. They've actually stitched this fabric on back to front. How bad is that? They've stitched it on back to front. And I think they've realised that when they've done it. But that is gorgeous. And what I'm going to do is to take off the panel. And um, if yeah, and I'll be able to do that in two pieces. Yeah, so I'm going to use that on my projects. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I knew when as soon as I saw it, they whoever made the skirt didn't even look to see how they'd pattern was and whether they'd done it the right way but you know that's it but you get people like that um i've got a nice surprise two surprises after now right, this was a surprise to me <laughs> i was looking for some originally looking for some fabric to make my cushion covers for summer for my garden furniture i've got two garden benches and i have two uh, they're like two chairs with a table between them and it's all one unit and then I've just got a long um, bench that Sadie bought us and I found that I just fell in love with it perfect and there's about uh, two meters of it I think but because I have big cushions that are actually they've got waterproof fabric on them so that you could leave them out but I don't like doing that so I put them away what I'm going to do with them is just cover them but I'm also going to do a piping around the edging. So I will film when I do that. But this, it, it's cream fa fabric. It's just stunning. And I'm going to use a cre plain cream background and just use the pattern material for the fronts. And that way I should get at least six out of it. Um, and I'll have some matching cushions because they're just, it's gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful material. And never been used, brand new, gorgeous. So I can't wait to make those for the summer. In fact, I will be getting on with those this week. Now, I did find this. Um, yeah, that material, I got that material for £3. <laughs> Sorry, but everything's three quid. And then I found this, which is a long piece of the shabby sheet. And unfortunately, there's not enough to do the, all the cushions because I would have done the cushions in that. So um, I'm going to keep this one and just use it for my projects when I need it because it's a real shabby sheet one and it's nice. And again, three quid the lot. <laughs> just three pound, three pound. This wasn't three pound. This was a little bit more. But I have to say, I'll tell you, um, and this one as well. Um, yes, I'm going to sell this because I do have one very similar myself. Now, I paid at the antique shop for one nearly identical to this, £24. And I bought it because it's antique, mint condition and 
um it was it's a beauty of the past that's what i call them beauties of the past and you just don't get them like that anymore okay so i'm going to fold this the right way um and i'm not sure if you can see it look i will take a picture of it so it's like that you've got that square in the middle and then you've got all the edging like that and then all the corners like that and it's just beautiful absolutely gorgeous and i didn't pay three pounds for this i have to say but that tablecloth vintage as it is in fantastic condition um and i want six six pound for that uh, because that's what i paid for it and i paid 24 for my own when I bought mine on a car boot second hand. But there you go. And it's well worth it for what it is. Beautiful condition. You might want to cut it up. But for six quid, it's worth it. This one, I just, I couldn't believe it when I saw it. And I think, um, if I'm mistaken, not mistaken, should I say. I think this is something to do with the Irish. I think, if I remember rightly, or the Welsh, one or the other. But it is absolutely beautiful and in mint condition. It's superb. Look at that. Sorry, can you see that workmanship? Who wouldn't want that on their table? It is just beautiful gorgeous can you actually see the workmanship in that yeah and that again is six pound um so i just i, I put the 12 pound in her pocket as you know in her hand as fast as i could <laughs> they're well worth it it's just beautiful absolutely gorgeous um you know they just don't make things like that anymore. That's the other pair of earrings. that are uh, butterfly. Um, that's those. And then I found this. And... Oops, sorry. In its own velvet case. And it's just beautiful absolutely stunning sorry can you see that it is gorgeous and you never guess how much it was oh you guessed it three pound <laughs> So if anybody's interested in that, honest to God, it is stunning. And comes in a velvet case. You know. Gorgeous. Three quid. There you go. She actually wanted £10 for it. And I knocked it down. And then she went, oh, seven. I went, no, I won't pay any more. So then she went, five. I went, no, I'm sorry. I'm not paying that for it. And uh, and then she went, three pound, I do no more, three pound. And I went, that'll do. <laughs> so yeah, three pound with a case that's velvet. There you go. So that's that. Then I managed to get this one. Now this lady said this uh, was one of the last ones. Her mother, she, her mother died last year. And she was the lady who crocheted in the family. Um, and so I bought this. And it's stunning. There's lots and lots of flowers in it. Spotless mint condition. A handmade. These are the 10 inch embroidery hoops. And um, they only, there was only three of these, but he threw them in. So <laughs> again, three pound. So it's the 10 inch embroidery hoop. You're getting that for three pound and a bundle of that. I will make the other one up. I'll make a bundle up. 
for the fourth one because there's four of these and I don't need them because I don't know if you noticed, I don't know, here's mine, let me just show you mine. Right, sorry, I'm just making sure they fit. Um, let me just get mine and you'll know what I mean. These are mine. And I just keep them hung up, <coughs> hung up, <coughs> I hang them up on my little hook and just use them when I need them. I do put them on a tie so they don't get lost. Um, I've only got one at the moment in use, but you're going to get a 10 inch one. <laughs> you're not. You'll get a 10 inch hoop. <laughs> Sorry, that really came out wrong and I shouldn't have said that. I do apologise. You'll get a 10 inch hoop and a free bundle of thread. <laughs> and I'll make another bundle up for the fourth one. So there's four of those and they're £3 each. So that's those. Sorry about that. I I am bad. I know I'm bad. I can't help it. When I've got my head on. Whoops a daisy. I'm really bad. So I'm just going to tighten these up. That's a great size actually if you are doing a project. Really good size to use. Then I'm just going to move those out the way. Because I did find this dress form yeah uh, you can undo it and redo it take all of this off and redo it yourself it's got a, a base on it and um, this will be taken off twisted off to post it and um, this one was five pound Yeah, so they're identical. So there's two of them. So I can send you those as they are, or we can take the middles out and just send you the thing. But the price won't, um, it won't lessen because if I take the cushions out, I'm just going to keep them at the same price because, you know, I've had to, I'm going to recover. I will dump the inside. I won't want that because I don't use that kind of uh, filler. Um but the price will be the same. And uh, these were £3 as well. They were £3 each. So if you want the pair, it's £6. I would actually keep them as a pair uh, with the inserts because it's just filled them out right. They're nice. And £3 for a cushion, crochet cushion. Oh, come on. Behave yourselves. That's not a lot. So I'm just going to put them down there in that bag. Um, now I've just got to show you these bits and pieces because that needs to go down there. I did manage to get some other bits and pieces that are quite nice. Yeah, you know, I did spend a fair bit, but you know, three quid here, three quid there. Um, don't turn your nose up at a bargain. Right, I'm just going to remove those now. This is a set, let me just move these out of the way because I managed to get some crystals. This is a set, it's a gorgeous set, it's brand new and it's Hill Interiors so you can go and check it out yourself. Nice little pin cushion there. A beautiful box, not a cheap box at all, they've not skimped on that box, it's really nice. You know, nice closure. This is fabric, um, and it, it was sold as a set. And then you have the fabric frame with the little hearts uh, saying home there, and all the, it's all fabric trimming, right? And that's eight pounds for the set, but I thought it was worth it because I know I've seen these for nine ninety nine in shops, very similar, just for that. So. I grabbed it, but I thought I, could, I can sell them individually, but I'd like to keep them as a set if somebody wants them. Absolutely gorgeous, and it's £8 for the set, okay? So that's that lot. I think that's a bargain, that's why I bought it.
Um, I'm going to show you these because I've got some more bits and pieces here. Have to be really careful. Right, I managed to find this little horse. See, so I'll be able to put that in a miniature somewhere. I then found my granddaughter this because I have a small collection that my father started me when I was younger and I've continued it on for my granddaughter which is the little Bambi but I loved it because it's a blue Bambi that cute um, so I do have a glass collection hopefully I don't break that now I found this I don't know if you see the colours it's just stunning that one so that's 150 for that Beautiful inside. Uh, this is a pound for the brooch. Which you can take the chain off and put pearl beads or something on it. So that's a brooch. Um, this was two pound. And I don't pass any of these up. Diamonds is just stunning. Pearl and Diamante. I love this one. It's more, uh, less is more, as my granddaughter tells me constantly. Like that, which is the droplet. Beautiful. You put that on anything. Um, that was £2. Um, this one was also £2, which is a double necklace. Um, but why I, I got it was because of the droplets on it. So you've got those with the heart and the uh, crystals and that. You've got the uh, horn, a uh, horn. Well, it is a horn sort of thing, or a tooth, whatever you want to call it. And those, and again, that's two pounds. So you have two danglers on there. This one is uh, three pound. Yeah. Now, I'm not sure what this piece is. Um, you can cut that bit off though. It does have a, a fastener on it, so I'm assuming it this fastens onto something. But it's all diamantes. It is quite heavy, and there's a lot on there you could use somewhere. This one, however, um, mm, I couldn't believe it. I was gobsmacked. This is all moonstone. Look at that. Look at that. It's absolutely stunning. Like that. Beautiful, beautiful necklace. And that one's £4.50. I couldn't resist it. I love Moonstone and I have uh, several necklaces that are Moonstone. Um, I couldn't buy that anywhere for that price. £4.50. So if you're interested in the Moonstone and you want a bit of class... And something that's, it'll last forever by yourself, something like that. Now, saying all of that, I did manage to find some of the crystal necklaces. And I was looking for the ones in particular that, like I say, um, uh, genuine crystals. Now, some of, you can get them, like I say, with the name on. I've got a couple here with the name on. But this one, look at that. No name on it, but it is vintage. It's got the circular clasp, and that tells you straight away it's vintage. And I can tell by the quality and the weight. So we've got that crystal one, right? So that one's £4. I, I can't do it. I've picked them up for this because I know people like them. This would have had more than one strand. It doesn't have a name to it that I can see unless it's on the bit you pull out. Let me just see. Can't remember how to get these out. Oh, it's that one, isn't it? Yeah, it's that one, isn't it? There it is. Oh, it has a mark on. Oh, it has. Oh, that's even better. But I can't sell it for any more than what I've paid for it. So, 
that's better for you lot let me just see the mark my eyes so bad i'm double vision i can't see it what i'll do is i will pop it i will uh i'll find the name as mark for you but again um these are four pound a piece even though that that's got the mark on but it's only one of the necklaces then you've got this one um and i think this is the one i like yeah i need the maker's mark it is a vintage one though i have to say double row and that one is eight pound and i can't let them go for any any less than that four pound four pound eight pound that one's the one with the mark on it this one also um it's not vintage but the crystals on it are gorgeous see the little droplets so that'd be one to take apart but that's at three pound fifty so the droplet one is three pound fifty the first two are four pound one is marked this one's a double row um and that's eight pound and then this one again is just beautiful look at the crystals on that gorgeous gorgeous crystals you can see the colors in them uh, again that one's four pound uh this one let me just look at the mark made in england it's got a pattern number six five nine nine six five oh uh, but there's obviously only one row left um but again um that's three pounds that one and uh, the last crystal one i've got here is a four pounder you know don't turn your nose up at genuine crystals you go with the glass things they'll chatter eventually these last forever so that's all i'm saying and then the last thing I bought was the string of glass pearls. It's go. It's a long necklace, and um, that was four pound. But you're getting an awful lot on there. So if you're interested in any of them, let me know. Not the horse. Not my granddaughter's Bambi. Can't have those at all. <laughs> But everything else is for sale. Thanks for watching. Take care. I'll speak to you all soon. Bye-bye for now.